Thank you for joining us today. We're going to talk some slack. Women's basketball, 1990s all-decade team. We are joined once again by Terry Logue, longtime administrator at Westminster College, Conference SID, you name it, Terry did it. Terry, how are you doing? Oh, I'm doing great. Well, you ready to talk some women's basketball? Let's, uh, let's as they say, fire it up. <laughs> All right, jump ball, here we go. We're going to kick it off by talking about we talked about them earlier, the program, the men's program. Let's talk about the women's program over at Blackburn College during the 1990s. Well, when you when you talk women's basketball in the 90s in this conference, you got to talk about Blackburn. Blackburn won three league championships, six tournament titles, <laughs> and they were led by a three-time coach of the year, uh, Jim Sexton. Uh, did a phenomenal job. A little side note that, you know, we talked about uh, – Blackburn playing in the small college athletic association tournament. The Blackburn women played in that tournament one year and they won it. That's right. Yep. They came away the national title. That's right. Um, you know, you mentioned Jim Sexton over there at Blackburn, another coach on this all decade team from Fompon, Keith Quigley. Can you tell us about Keith a little bit? Well, you know, Keith uh, has a, a lot. We can, we could talk about Keith all day because he, uh, and we will talk about him in golf later on, but he was a five-time coach of the year, guided Font Bon to uh, three league championships and two tournament championships. Yes, that, that's pretty impressive. So Blackburn and Font Bon, both um, stellar standout programs during the 90s. What are some players, as you look down this list, that you, were, you, you remember being impressed by? Well, you know, there's a there's a Hall of Famer who ended up coaching at Bon Bon, Kim Kudis. She was a two time first team all conference performer, you know, a very competitive young lady in her playing days. Um, there was Val Duncan, a two time uh, rebounding champion from Greenville and a three time all conference performer. Um, Amy Shaper Cotter, four-time all-conference performer from Westminster in the Hall of Fame. And I've got to mention Hallie Spann. Um, she overlapped in the, in the early 2000s. She's in the Hall of Fame, but she, she was a phenomenal player. Uh, we also have got um, Holly Wachtel of McMurray. She was player of the year in 99, a four-time all-conference performer. Deanne Vallow, tournament MVP in 96 for McMurray, a four-time all-conference performer. And then I would be remiss if I didn't mention the, a three-time scoring champion from Principia, Laura Williams, a three-time first-team all-conference performer. And, and she could light it up. <laughs> yes, uh, looking back, you know, she's still up there in the record book. You know, it's, it's really, really outstanding to see these players, um, especially in women's basketball, when the conference is, you know, new, it was just formed, um, still to have that impact 30 years later um, and have, see their names listed all in the record books. Um, so, Terry, I want to thank you again for talking uh, Slack Women's Basketball, and we look forward to moving on to the spring sports and talking some all-decade teams there. <laughs>